Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to a new edition of Survival Story. Look at this thing that I've built. <laughs> what is it, you ask? I have no idea. It's 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 terrible. It's so bad. We need to take it down. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so I've been working, and I will not lie to you. Okay, here's here's what has happened. I have been working here now for. Uh, Five hours, maybe? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Five hours in my single-player world. Um, and I had this idea about this ore processing room that somehow I'd manage easily to connect these uh, chimneys that I made on top of the um, uh, processing machines. And I'll connect them by having, like, a big air drum over top. Uh, and it would look really great, I thought. Well... <laughs> Look at that, Mr. Strongman holding it up, in it? Yeah, 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 it's, it's terrible. Let's take it down. We're gonna take it down, don't you worry, I'll take it down. So how are you today? Are you having the same frustration level as I do? Where? There we go. I, I can never find you, Mr. Destroyer. Uh, boop, let's put some stuff away. I hope that you're having a good day anyway. Oh, check this out, I found this guy. I wanna show you this. What is this, by the way? It's a warded zombie, mm -hmm. and he cannot die. Maybe, oh, 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 he's dying! You have no idea how long I tried that, but he was in water when I found him up on the mountain. And now he just died. He had some kind of shield. Craziness. Okay, that was my big reveal. That took one second, okay. Well, stupid. Uh, where were I? I completely lost where I were. Oh yeah, we're gonna take this down. It's stupid. It's stupid. We're gonna have to come up with a better way of dealing with things. Uh, <clears throat> so, I'm back from Easter, and guess what, guys? Today, it is the... It, it's spring. Today is spring in Sweden. Or actually, this week has been spring. Sun is up until 8. In the evening. How amazing isn't that? It's warm, you know, me and my girlfriend were sitting on the balcony earlier today, just chilling, you know, just chilling, having a good time. And I just love it. Uh, it changes so much when it gets springtime. Uh, so, yeah, I'm really happy about that. Really happy. And it made me build this stupid air filter thing. Uh, so, I don't know if it's good for my Minecraft uh, world, but hey. It can deal with it. It's the second spring this... No, it's not. It's the second spring my Minecraft YouTube channel has seen. So that's kind of interesting. We're over a year now. Uh, and it's thank thanks to you guys um, that, that I can do this. So... Uh, or that I continue to do this, I should say. Because if I get... If I would have gotten no feedback, I'd just be playing my by myself. So... Uh, yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much. Love you guys. Mm-hmm. That's from the bottom of my heart. Okay, so I've been doing some other stuff apart from putting up this stupid air thing, whatever it was, and now it's nearly gone. Um, I have, for example, installed a second one of these processing machines. Mm -hmm. Let's come down here. This is the final design that I went with. I think it looks pretty good. We got the lamp here. Uh, so whenever ore is being processed, these lamps turns on. Someone said in the comments, put lamps on each side. And so I did put them on two sides. Look at that. Now they're going on and check the smoke coming out. Coming out, coming out, coming out. Look at that. It's even coming out from the sides. How cool isn't that? I don't know how I achieved it. I think it's when the smoker, because it's right down here. Can I, can I poke in here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's right there. So I think if it's like a lot of area where it can't float, it will press through the walls. Now turn it off, the ore is done. Oh, that's so cool. I'm really happy with it. Uh, <clears throat> I also added... I just need to get rid of this so that I can think clearly. I can think clearly. I shouldn't sing today. I shouldn't sing. I have a weird throat coming up. I can feel it again. Spring? No, my body will, will still get super weird... Uh, flues? I don't know. Anyway, um, I added a catwalk, also suggested by Joe, who, by the way, suggested basically this whole building. He didn't talk about the design or anything, but he said a catwalk and processing machines in a, in a line. So that's what I did, and I'm really happy I changed it up. 
And you guys are as well. So thank you, again. But thank you. You guys said in the last episode that it was fun to see me blow up the things in 91. And, and it was fun to see me rebuild it much prettier uh, in, in 92. And Blaze, today maybe, just maybe, you'll have your office back. He's grumpy. Who cares? I don't. <laughs> anyway. What else did I do? I changed up these. And I, I put this wall up, I guess. That's looking pretty good, isn't it? I like it. Uh, and I changed it up so we have the lines coming down here. And this was also a comment that I saw in the last video. <clears throat> now they're coming down under and then I install a glass here so we can see the items and then they're coming up. So this way, workers, which we're totally going to add, some Blaze have to have some people to manage, right? They're going to be walking down here. And I think that's really cool. This chest is was highly temporary. We can remove it now. I was testing... I was testing if we were getting stone from that machine, so let's grab the wrench. Boop. There you go. Uh, we need a golden glass. Gold edge glass, I think is the name. Boop. Mm-hmm. There we go. <laughs> One guy said as well that there was... I, I was doing my boop sound that I do... Uh, every now and then, and I was doing it when I was connecting conduits, and I apparently missed one. <laughs> And he said there was one, two little boops in this video. Oh, I love you. Thank you. <laughs> that, was, that was a good comment. Um, anyway, this is how it turned out from um, uh, the whole s sorting thing. And I... Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's Look at that. The ore is coming down. I'm actually interested to see if my timing needs to be raised. There's the quartz. It goes in. We can hear it. So we have sound effects. And the machine is already turned off. Okay, so I need to raise it. I have it at 15 seconds. That easily done. That easily done. That is easily done. Just come down here and watch our state cells. And we can increase it by 10. Sounds like a plan? Sure. Why not? Let's try it. There is something weird here though. And I'm going to put this out here. Maybe someone knows why this happens. Uh, this chest here. <clears throat> if I put stuff in it. This comparator goes on. But this line of red alloy wire does nothing. And I'm not sure why that is. I've tried breaking it and placing it back and I don't know. I don't know if it's because it has a cover here. No. Very weird. If you have any idea, you let me know. Because that basically ruins my on-off signal whenever I have ore coming in that line there. Uh, but anyway, today guys, I want to... Oh shoot, I missed the sunset. I was going to show you that I have installed Halcyon Days now. I have it in every Minecraft series I do. I'm a freaking addict. You know what I got to do though? I have to get rid of these stupid Natura clouds. They are gone in the config file, so they do not generate anymore. But in this area, uh, they were on when I generated my factory area. So basically, all I have to do is come up and do this. Or, wait a minute. Can we do can we do the torch uh, Tomcraft trick? I think we can probably. Uh, so let's take <laughs> this is a sidetrack, but who cares? There we go. Oh yeah, it's still gonna take like freaking ages though. But this is something I have to do uh, to get rid of these stupid ugly clouds. It's such a good feeling though. I cannot stop. I'm an addict to removing the clouds now. You have to admit, guys, you're enjoying this. <laughs> Me tapping on clouds with torches. No, no, let's go do something productive, shall we? I'll do that later. Uh, so today, what I want to do is try and finish this build, because I've been walking around in the factory, and I think we're going to take a little tour here at the end, towards the end of the episode. Uh, because I realize some new viewers have come and some old viewers have probably left and there's been like 20 episodes or so since we actually took uh, a walk down the factory and we have a lot of stuff there uh, so I want to do that today but before I want to try finish this and one of the things I wanted was that air filter another thing that I've been thinking of is instead of having the items just being collected into this interface why don't we make something cool here so let's find the center. We got the center right there. Um, and we'll just do a little bit on camera and then I'll do this off camera. But what I'm thinking is, you remember the pipe we did over at the... Was it over here? This pipe here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's so pretty. I think it's superb. It's superb. It's transporting copper 
Uh, although it's not doing anything, it's just for aesthetics. Do I have berries? Uh, that's not good enough. Let me get a burger. I still... Nigger! Uh, I still I still need to do some food situation fixing because that's still very bad. Uh, anyway, this pipe here. What if we make a big pipe come out of this building and we'll just see if we can lay something down here. Uh, what was I thinking? I was thinking like this. Oh my goodness, my nose is runny. Uh, we come over there and then we try to connect it over here. I've kind of started to tear this thing down. We had like a, uh, a decorative thing. Uh, hmm, hmm, hmm. Something like this we had. We're gonna rebuild that here, but inside it we are going to put this input thing. So essentially the, the items will just be traveling over here and then into an ME interface, but we won't be we will be seeing it. So we'll kind of visualize the whole thing, which I'm a big fan of after we added the lore to this series. Uh, and it makes sense because this is on the back side of our main room here. Mm -hmm. Pretty cool, eh? So we'll bring the pipe over and I'm thinking... Mm, is this the center? Yes. So maybe the pipe comes in here. That would be the center. So it would come down like so and so. By the way, I have a big question for you guys in regards of this factory uh, sometime in this episode. So don't you dare to skip through it and crazy about math. Don't you play this double speed, you crazy. <laughs> he said that yesterday on the fan server. He was like, I watch all your videos in double speed because otherwise they get boring. <laughs> oh. Do you guys do that, by the way? I didn't even know it existed. Yet alone that anyone would use it. Um... It's fine. I mean, it's fine. Whatever you want to do, as long as you watch the video, you watch the video, that's it. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm joking. Uh, but maybe we come over like so, and we bring it... Yeah, 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 we bring it up here. Is that the right height? Here, let's just... Uh, uh, uh. This is probably the wrong height. I can feel that it, this is the wrong height. Oh, it was the right! Mm -hmm. So we do this, and we come... One, two... One. So it would come here, just a rough sketch, so don't you worry. Um, and then we drop it down here. Yeah, 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 I think this will look really cool. And then we add some support beams to it, like we could come... Uh, wait a minute, we do have... Didn't we have something around it? Oh yeah, yeah, we have those. So we can do those and then add support in them. Uh, let's do one together here. So something like this. Uh-huh, and then, and then, boom, boom, but rather than running the uh, tanks inside them, we will run the item conduits now that we have them, so that we can see the items being transported in here, and the idea I have is that I want to be able to, like, when I walk around here, I, I can look up and I can see items traveling in the pipes, I think that's a, a fun little thing that I want to, that I want to have, and that actually has a function, so, yeah. We do uh, support beams, something like that maybe, and we do them, yeah, very, pr pretty often, maybe uh, we do, wait, let's just try something. What if we do this, that, and this, you see what I'm going with this? We do that, and we do that every other block, and then when we've done three of those, we do another support, like as all. That may look cool. I'm trying to add things here to the yard because it looks weird at the moment as well. So this is actually a perfect thing. A perfect idea. <laughs> I know. I'm so perfect. I'm freaking... No. I'm just playing. Uh, we do this and... I just want to get a feel. <laughs> uh, did we... Yep. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. And do that. <clears throat> Now I'll stop. I'll stop. I'll do. I'll do the rest of camera. Just a second. Just give me a moment to play some blocks. There we go. Oh, I like that. Oh, that looks cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like that a lot. That's pretty. And then we run the item uh, conduits. No, item ducts. Item ducts. Item ducts. These guys inside here. Uh, boop. 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 Will that look weird? I wonder. 
a little bit weird, to be honest. Yeah, yeah, a little bit weird. It's a, it's a little bit like, where's the support for the stupid, uh, <laughs> for the stupid item duck then? Um, we could also do conveyor belts, but the issue is I'm gonna be running around here with a magnet. I think we'll go with the item ducts. Are there, by the way, there are big item ducts, or there are big ducts, but I think they are only for power. These here... Oh, we're gonna do something cool with these, by the way. That's, that's one of the things I wanna talk to you about. These are so freaking good looking. Oh, man. Wish they, wish they were item ducts, though. They aren't. If I said that thing is huge, what, what do you say then? Oh, you're such a filthy, filthy boy. Stop those thoughts. <laughs> uh, well, it's, it's massive. That's what, you, no. It's big. God dang it. <laughs> anyway, the pipe is done. The pipe is done. I think it's pretty cool. Uh. Wow, look at, look at how the sunset colors the world as well. That's what I like the most with this texture pack with Optifine. Um, the, the colored lighting effect that it gives. Anyway, <clears throat> it's it's done pretty much. The, the structure anyway. We get to play around with a little bit of things here. Uh, one thing is the glass that I put in here. Um... I don't know, I just felt like we needed some glass there, and I wanted to try also the gold-edged ones. See how that looks, because I'm not overly happy with this. This is just fused glass, I think it's called. Yeah, fused, fused quartz, even. What if we do this? Hero. Oh. Can't I? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Can't I equal trade fused quartz? No. <laughs> okay, let's just try a little bit of this here. See if we like it. I I think this could really uh, add a color to it, if you will. Yeah, I think that's pretty. Let's do the other side. Let's do the other side. Like so. Uh-huh. And maybe we come over here. Oh, that sucks that I can't equal trade it. Mm, I was going to try like five different types here quickly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This looks good though. I like the, I like this. I think that's what we go in. I think that's what we go in with. Uh, I can't English today. Sue me. <laughs> that looks good. I like that. The the yellow line there that adds so much. It doesn't have to be glass in our imagination. It could be something else. It could be like caution lines. Um, but it's pretty big. It takes up a lot of focus when you come into the factory. I noticed, which is cool. I, you know, it's. It's good that we get things going here. Uh, it also connects up the two buildings. <clears throat> this building, I just ran out of inspiration for this building right now, but uh, I'm gonna work on it some other day or, or some other time. Uh, it's nothing that I want to do today. That's a thing that I can, if you do YouTube recordings, if you don't feel, feel like doing a building, like wait with it. Don't do it at the moment. Wait with it. You can do it some other day. Uh, important thing is that it turns out good, isn't it? Don't know what we're gonna do with this, uh, but we'll see. Anyway, uh, the the line, the conduit is in here, or item conduit, and it goes over here. Can I break? Yeah, yeah, and into an interface, okay? So it is functioning. All we have to do is come up with how we want to connect this up on this side. Um, and an interesting finding You'll notice that there's a diamond chest here, or what's a diamond chest here? An interesting finding is, if we do this, um, let's just connect this ugly for now. If we connect these up, like as so, oops, uh huh, that will work for for this processing unit. But if we connect up a second one, I notice that only one item can be shipped. At any time so now what would happen is that items would get stuck in this or, or in one of them while the other ones are being sent which is fine as long as we're just running the drill uh, but if we run an ender quarry that's gonna be an issue so what we got to do is something like I don't know at the moment uh, but I'm figuring we'd need like a box up here again a box <laughs> like we have on the other side eh? Um, we'll do something like, come out like that, maybe. This is highly temporarily, by the way. How are we for... 
Yeah, let's just do it across because this isn't this isn't centered by any mean. Break you a little bit. I like this catwalk, by the way. Really like that. Did I say we need an office for Blaze? I think I did. If so, Blaze, I'm sorry. That's gonna be your office. This little building here. This is your office. Deal with it. Mm -hmm. You shouldn't be sitting in an office. You should be uh, managing and overlooking, superioring, supervising your, your employees that you don't have at the moment. Um, so if we do this, what about having, we put down some chests here and we hide them, of course. Uh, maybe not diamond chests. Let's grab some iron ones. Yeah, 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 that's fine. I don't want to waste no diamonds on this. And what I'm thinking is we do this for all four of them, right? Uh, and then the backlog will be in the iron chests rather than in the... Um, uh, in the machine actually we need to move these further one so let's do that let's come out here and oops actually <laughs> I'll do that because I don't have any other block stupid me okay there uh, we do something like that and then we pull out all of the items from the is this one too little here yes it is we pull out the items from the top like this just so that we don't get the backlog situation in the diamond chests. Make sense? Yeah, yeah. You understand this. You be smart. You be smart now. Remove you, remove you. I think that's how we'll do it. And then we'll hide that. Uh, but I still have to figure that out. I'm thinking we'll do something similar to what we did here, though. I really like this. Coming down. You know, it makes sense in my head. And then we can remove you. Oh, is this just a dead end? What the crap? What the crap? Why are you? Why are you just? Uh, oh yeah, yeah, I had it. Oh yeah, that's a cover. I removed it. That's right. Um, but what I'm thinking is we will take these. They will pop out of the machine. I like that effect. And then we'll come down and disconnect you and do kind of like we did, or exactly like I did over there, right? That makes sense, so I'll do that off camera, but basically, that would be cool. Uh, but, we're gonna leave this building for now, I'll, I'll finish that up. I need to put details in here, uh, I've got suggestions in the past for what to do in these type of buildings. So I'm gonna take a look at them again in the comments field. But now, what I wanna do is, I wanna take a tour with you guys. I wanna invite you to the old factory, to the tunnels, if you will. And, I wanna ask you guys a really important question. Do we renovate? Okay, that's the question. Do we renovate? Reno renovate? I need to know this. I need to know that this is okay with you guys. Because we have this awesome tunnel system here. But it's really... Hi. Come here. It's really, really uh, broken at the moment. Because everything was based on applied logistics. And obviously, we have no network here. Or the cables that are connected in the background here somewhere. Everywhere. These. Uh, doesn't serve a purpose at the moment, and we're better than this now. We're trying to do things lore-wise, right? So, uh, we can make it prettier, uh, without having everything so super automated. Um, so do we renovate? I want to use this style. I want to use these tunnels. I need a lot of rooms. We're gonna put everything that is production in the factory, okay? So let's take a little roll. We have, first of all, the shipping room up here. We need to come up with a proper use for this room because I'm just, you know, I'm just putting down things randomly here at the moment. Look at this. This is where I come when I had to workshop something. I I was smelting something there probably. Uh, give me some of these berries. I'm stupid. I'm 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 stupid. Did I just say I'm stupid? I did. I meant I'm hungry. <laughs> Hamburger. Why won't you let me eat you? Okay. Uh, anyway, the land, uh, the, the docking room, the, uh, I like this room, but we need to find a proper use for it. So if you got any ideas, you know where to, where to post them. This room here was our old server room. And I think I've, I've just, with the help of a, of a fan, we've just cleared this out and covered in, in this corp thing for now. Uh, this is also a testing room for me where I've tried out things, uh, that I've never showed you. So this room, I think what we'll do is probably bring back the very old server room, the very first server room that we built. You guys love that room. And 
Uh, we have a big, big AE central now, so all we need here is a place for this and for some channels to come out. Okay? So we'll do that here. That's already something that I've decided in my head. <clears throat> then, here's the interesting level with the tunnels. What I would like to do here is to keep this field that we have here, but instead of running tesseracts everywhere, what about doing cryothium? I'm sure I had... Oh, I have them in my inventory. How convenient. What about running like power lines like this? Wouldn't that be cool? So, these can transfer infinite power. They are not done yet, by the way. You need to dip them in cryothium. But, uh, what about running them like in the ceiling and really incorporate them, incorporating them in the build? Because if you remember, very early in the series, I said that I would like to decorate with cables. But there wasn't any pretty cables that we could use that actually worked or had a function. But now, we have thermodynamics and these are super, super pretty. <clears throat> so we'll have like a power main power line coming down and we'll use tesseracts when tesseracts are you uh, are due But we'll try to base everything off a main power line What about that guys? Uh, but if we are to do that we need to do some renovation what I'm thinking is we'll keep this tunnel style But we will kind of punch out. This is our uh, pneumatic craft room and behind here I think we're kind of free with space yeah, we wasn't before, we weren't before because of the A room above us that started like uh, there where you see that, so I broke it, there it started. <laughs> um, but now we're free to, to modify this, so I think we take the whole pneumatic craft room out is the plan. Because we are not using pneumatic craft anytime soon anyway, you guys don't even want to see it, so uh, we, we need the space. We take that out. This room here is a production room. We expand this because we need to be producing cobblestone, sand, gravel, all that stuff that we are produ that we were producing in here. Um, and there are other things that we need to produce. Okay, this is the potion auto crafting thing. It's no longer working because it was powered by AE. AE. What is this ender chest? Uh, so I'm thinking we take that out as well, right? Uh, this was my original machine room, like manual machine room, and one of the thoughts I had for the landing room, up up twice, uh, was to put the manual machines in these. So maybe that's a thing we do, because every now and then you just want to manually smelt down something. Uh, so that could be a thing. Remember, the factory should be all about production, and the A room should be all about storing. That's how I see it, or the A base, the Silicon Valley thing. <coughs> um... Again, this room would need to be expanded, and we can do that now, because before we couldn't, because above here we had the power room that we're no longer using, that I'm planning on removing anyway, and it looks like crap at the moment, so I don't even want to show it to you. I don't even want to show it to you. Um, what is over here? This is the nice looking tunnel, I <coughs> really like this. Uh, up here is the very first area of the factory. This was the first room we built. Up here where was where we slept our first night. We had a 9 by 9 right up here. Pretty cool. That was a long time ago. Nearly a year ago, guys. Can, can you imagine how amazing that is to have like a YouTube series that long? I like it. Anyway. Uh, so this room doesn't really fit the theme anymore. I don't build like this. Uh, I can definitely do this better. I think it's still, still pretty. But we can do better. Um, and we have space here. Uh, we have the meat room here that we're no longer using because we installed Spice of Life and all that. This was our... <laughs> this was how we were producing our food. Uh, and in here... Is this still here? I had a redstone contraption up here. No, it's removed. Look at how this looks. Ugh, I just want to nuke it. <laughs> uh, this was my old water production room. I took it down because the Aquimis accumulator thingies was super loud. By the way, we used these for lighting in the beginning. Um, let's take them away though. I'm not very, you know, I'm, mu I'm not much for memories. Come on now, that's weird. Um, so if we come down again. So the point here is that we have a lot of space to do things up there. We could... Remove this elevator and build three rooms here instead. That could be cool. Um, and we've been there. Okay, so if we go down one more level, we're down in the 
subscriber room or fan room, I should say, not subscriber room, uh, fan room where I had all my giveaways on this screen here. It's no longer working. Uh, draw. New, I think, was the latest version. It takes some time to build up because it's connecting to the interwebs. This is where I picked the random winner of the... Uh, giveaway system and you've been asking about the giveaway i think i said that in the last episode as well that <laughs> 238 comments now wow when we did this we had 20 to 30 comments thereabouts uh, <clears throat> but anyway uh, i'm no longer doing this because of many reasons reasons that i don't have to go to again but we're gonna do giveaways but we're gonna do them differently and not scheduled or anything i had so many people that only watched my videos and skipped through them and saw if they won anything that you know it didn't make any sense to me um the trophy still this is bob although the the name computer isn't working at the moment i think i disconnected it because i was lag busting uh, this is Bob. He won something and then never ever returned <laughs> to watch the series. Nero's also no longer with us, or <laughs> no longer with us, but uh, Doc, Retchka, uh, Willy, Wally, Biffa, Clock, uh, Kempo Kid. Yeah, 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 yeah. I I knew that. <laughs> JP Miner. Um, so do we, the, the question is here, I really like this room, this is my favorite room of the factory. Do we keep it like it is and then kind of re, because these farms are still working, some of them at least. Um, they need maintenance, <laughs> they need, they need to be oiled. Uh, but do we keep it and redo the whole farm idea or what do we do with this room? You let me know what you think. Um, renovations are due in the factory for sure. And that's what happens when you build a lot of things. Can I, can I come up here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This room, this floor though, is gonna be the most interesting. I like this idea. I hope you do too. Anyway, that is gonna do it for today, guys. I hope that you have enjoyed this episode. And uh, if you have, of course, be sure to hit that like button. Let's try to hit 100. That would be awesome. Uh, do leave some comments down below. I've been pretty bad at answering over uh, Christmas, over uh, Easter, because I didn't have interwebs, so. I'll be, I'll be attending to answering. I've read them all. I always read the comments immediately when I get them. So, <laughs> yep, you know that. Uh, so keep commenting, keep giving me suggestions. And I see you in the next episode.